Nearly 20 years after 18-year-old Natalie Holloway disappeared during a trip to Aruba, the prime suspect in the case has been extradited to the United States. Joran Vandersloot faces extortion and wire fraud charges. Fox's Jonathan Seri reports. The main suspect in the disappearance of 18-year-old Natalie Holloway is now in U.S. custody. A plane filled with FBI agents transferred Euron Vandersloot from Peru to Birmingham, Alabama on Thursday. There, he faces federal charges for alleged financial crimes against the Holloway family. The closure may come in that they get to face him in court in the United States. Vandersloot is currently serving a 28-year sentence in Peru for the murder of a 21-year-old woman. Peru agreed to his temporary extradition to the U.S to stand trial on extortion and wire fraud charges. He was indicted in 2010 after allegedly providing Natalie's mom with false information about the location of her daughter's body in exchange for money. There was no body buried where he said there was, and Vandersloot was able to flee Aruba to Peru before we were able to file our charges against him here. The 18-year-old Alabama woman disappeared in 2005 during a high school senior trip to Aruba. She was last seen leaving a bar with Vandersloot. He was initially arrested by police but was released due to lack of evidence. Natalie's remains have never been found. It's highly likely that Vandersloot met her at the casino, slipped her some date rape drugs, met her out on the beach. She had a she she overdosed or she had an overdose incident with the drugs and he dumped her body in the ocean. That's the working theory. Once criminal proceedings wrap up here, Vandersloot will return to Peru to serve the rest of his murder sentence. In Birmingham, Alabama, John Seri, Fox News.